what is going on, on youtube this is your boy cali and we're back with another video 49ers going to the super bowl super stoked i i just haven't had time to edit a video lately but today i was doing something um that i hadn't done here in the shop and i thought i'd share it with you guys um a customer brought in uh, this mechanical keyboard um to recycle um so what we're gonna do now is uh clean it up test it see um if it's still functional or not um it is a logitech uh oh, fuck it. a g610 um so uh i started to take off the the keycaps right now um and then i thought you know what this might be a good video so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna set up the camera um up here that way we can have a, a down view and um Let's uh let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so we switched over to the DSLR right now. Um, so let's go ahead and uh, finish removing the keys. As you can see, it's it's pretty dirty. So. Um, and I do have the, the key remover. I'm just doing it like this because it's a lot faster. So, Jesus Christ. I don't understand how some of you people can eat at your keyboard, man. And this is fucking disgusting. But we'll go ahead and clean this, sanitize it for sure. And then, um, you know, get it uh, ready I mean as you guys know or you can probably see in the background um, I have a Logitech keyboard now it's not a full mechanical keyboard it is that uh, that one that has a that weird wannabe mechanical membrane but I got it because I needed it to be wireless um, and Lina said that this was the best wireless mechanical keyboard so oh wait no 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 this isn't the one that he recommended or is it I, I can't remember honestly I think he might have mentioned it but um, it is definitely uh, pretty good when it comes to being wireless so that is what I'm going with why is there so much fucking hair on this sorry about the cursing but Jesus I'm just gonna have to move this over here I know I can just take them off without arranging them, but some of my OCD would kick in and it would it would just be a problem. So I'm just gonna do it this way. Oh my god, this thing's freaking mess. Here we go. Well, there it is. As you guys can see, it is super, super dirty. I don't even know where to start. Oh, you know what? Give me one second. I do know where to start. All right, here we go. <laughs> we use this toothbrush for a bit, get some of it, and then I got some cotton swabs, so. <sighs> Fuck, I don't even know where to begin, but um, yeah, let's go ahead and try to get as much of this hair out of here. Dude, this is... I just really hope that this is in pubes, man. That's why I'm wearing gloves. Like, she said it was her son's. So I don't know what homeboy was doing with these, this keyboard, man. I mean, just, ugh. Let me just tilt it first, see how much we can get. By doing this, should have done that at the beginning. Wow, that's that's too much, man. Uh, I'm just gonna do it this way so nothing else gets in there. So. <sighs> Glue. Oh man, I, uh, 
the hell is that? I mean, I just like I don't. I'm not even gonna ask what the hell that is, bro. Because you know how teenage boys are. You dirty. Yes. All right, that's it. Time lapse because um, I'm gonna. Yeah, I don't think I can speak while I'm doing this. Jesus. Cleaned it as much as possible, so that I wipe it down, you know, add some other stuff. But now, uh, let's go ahead and test it. Let me plug it into the computer. There we go. Alright, so we know that's working. Let's take a look here. Let me just... Do a quick. Alright, it looks like all the keys are. Oops, number locks. As you can see, well, I don't know, you guys can't see, but I'm testing the keyboard and it's working fine. So, I mean, it's a. Uh, it's a G10. Uh, I have the, uh, the G10. It's a G610. I have the G6. Uh, 13 which is the wireless model um, but I mean 
I don't know. Overall, it's a, it's a pretty good keyboard. We can either uh, keep it for here in the shop or, uh, you know, I might. So as you guys can see, the backlight uh, also works and it has a couple modes that you can go through um, to bring up the brightness or not. Uh, I got a good, good double check to see um, if it has one for it to permanently stay on. Um, but as of right now, you know, uh, everything's working. Um, the keyboard, uh, all the keys are working properly. So I don't know if I'm just going to keep it here for for the shop or, you know, sell it as used or what we're going to do with it. Um, so, I mean, I don't know if one of you guys uh, want a slightly used uh, G610, you can always let me down in the comments below and uh, I'll probably uh, send it out or something. So I don't know what I'm going to do with it. Uh, anyways, that was uh, the short video for today. Uh, oh, we decided what we're going to do for the giveaway for 100 subscribers. Um, so we are going to give away the two uh, iPhone Tech uh, toolkits. iPhone Tech. Oh my God, I'm an idiot. The <laughs> iFixit Pro Tech toolkits. Um, so I'm going to open up that uh, uh, the Gleam. Uh, we're going to leave it running until we get uh, enough people. I mean, last time we had a, a decent amount. Um, but I really want to get uh, a lot of people to get the opportunity so they can win that uh, that prize. All you have to do is be subscribed to the channel. Uh, go ahead and follow my Instagram and my Facebook and uh, complete the steps on the Gleam. Uh, I will see you guys in the next video. Hopefully we'll do the walkthrough then. We've cleaned up somewhat uh, the shop here. So uh, we'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.